This seems to be like where all the little babies grow up. Oh, wow. We caught something new. 100% we caught something new. What are those? Look at those fins, bro. That is gorgeous. Oh, those are so sick. Oh my gosh, look at all the turtles. We got one here, one there, one down there, one over there, one there. We got some gars. Dude, we got lots of life going on already. What is up, VFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video. As you can tell, guys, we're back at the exotic canal. This is the OG spot. This is where we first caught African cichlids. If this happens to be your first video you've seen on the channel, well, basically this canal freaking holds all these crazy exotic cichlids and other fish. And every time we come here, we seem to catch something really, really cool and something new. So I decided to come back today after a little bit of a break from here. You know, we've been busy finding other spots, but we're back today and we got the OG trap and we got some bread. We might use another trap. We might put two traps out here this video, but for now it's going to be the OG one and some bread. So this is like the hot spot right here because it's like the big intersection for these canals. You got the canal going this way, canal going this way, a canal over there that you can't see going this way, and a canal over there. So it's literally an intersection. Let's set up the first trap and uh, get going. Let's see what we can get today. There we go. All right. Let's give this one a couple pieces, break it up a little bit, and we're good to go. Let's go. Right in front of the pipe as usual. Oh, there's a gar swimming right by it. We don't want the gar. All right, the trap is set, guys, right in front of the pipe. This is literally the best fish trap spot you can think of because you, like I said, you got four canals and they all lead through this big pipe right here. So yeah, this is literally perfect, guys. Let's go grab a smaller trap and place it in this shallow one. This one's very shallow. And as you can see, there is still a lot of fish in there. If you look closely, you'll see them all swimming. Oh, there's a nice size molly. That one right there, what is that? That's a little baby cichlid of some sort. But yeah, this seems to be like where all the little babies grow up because it's real nice and shallow. So we'll place a little trap here. All right, let's go ahead and get this, this trap baited up. All right, one piece should be good enough. I'm really excited to see what we get in this one, guys. Because like I said, I see so many little fish. We're going to place it like this. There we go. We're all set. So we got this little baby trap for the little tiny fish and we got the big trap for the big fish. The traps are set to pass the time a little bit. I'm gonna walk down one of these canals and just see what I can see because the water's super clear today. It's the most clear I've ever seen the exotic canal and I'm just gonna walk down it, film it, and uh, maybe we see something cool. So we'll be back in a couple hours to check our fish traps. Let's go explore this exotic canal. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is so clear today. You can literally see everything in there. Well guys, my exploration was cut a little bit short because it is raining. So you know what? We're just gonna pick this up when it's time to check the traps. Cause uh, yeah, I'm not going out of this. It is time to check the fish traps now. I was planning on waiting a little bit longer uh, to check them, but there's a huge storm rolling in and I don't wanna have to film this in the pouring rain. So we're just gonna go for it now. All right, here we go. Let's fill up the bucket. I see fish in there. We do have fish. Can't tell what they are yet. Oh wow! Oh my gosh, dude! Oh, this is freaking sick. Hold on. Look at this, guys. I'm trying to keep them in the water a little bit, but look, dude. We caught something new. 100%. We caught something new. What are those? Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, we're gonna get them in the bucket. I can't tell what they are yet. There we go. What the heck were those? Let's try to find one of them. We caught a bunch of these fish that I don't recognize. They're the ones with the stripes right here. Look, come here, buddy. Dude, what the heck are these? Oh, they're gorgeous, dude. They kind of look like jewel cichlids. That's definitely not a jewel cichlid though. It looks like a jewel cichlid Mayan hybrid almost. At first glance, that's what, oh my gosh, wait. Oh, you know what that might be, guys? That might be a baby Jack Dempsey. I think those are baby Jack Dempsey's. We just caught a bunch of babies. There's another. That is so sick. I think those are Jack Dempsey's. Look, you see the blue on them? You see the gold? I think that's a Jack Dempsey. That's gotta be. Guys, a little backstory. We've only caught one Jack Dempsey in these chains of canals and it was a bigger one. It was like, you know, maybe that big. And I had no idea what it was. I had never heard of a Jack Dempsey before that video and you guys told me what they were. Ever since then, I've never caught another one here. I've never seen another one. And I was wondering if maybe it was just someone's pet that they let go in here. So there was only one and I got lucky and I caught it, but this proves me wrong. These guys are breeding in here for sure. What is that? Oh, it's a baby African. But let's see what else we got. And I wonder how many we caught. That's a bigger one. Dude, those are so sick. 
Look at the colors on them, baby Jack Dempsey's. We got some bigger fish in here too. African cichlid, molly. We gotta count how many of these guys we have, dude. These are baby, these are baby Jack Dempsey's. All right, we're gonna get these guys on an aerator and then we're gonna go check the trap behind us. Well guys, before I was gonna check the big trap, I went to go get them some clean water cause all the bread kind of clouded it up and I wanted to get them fresh water. And uh, well, one of the Jack Dempsey's scurried off. So minus one Jack Dempsey. All of the bread is gone. So that either means we have a turtle or a lot of fish. Please, no turtle. Please, no turtle. Oh, I got something big. Oh, there's something big in here, dude. Oh, it's a big mine. That was, that's what ate all the freaking bread, dude. That's a giant mine cichlid. A lot of Africans, some good ones too. A lot of good Africans, wow. And that's about it. Let's get this mine out first, dude. This guy is huge. Look at that. <laughs> that's a giant mine. Look at that African, wow. Dude, his fins are beautiful. Look at those fins, bro. That is gorgeous. Oh, uh, we got another Mayan, or another African, I mean. We got a big boy, wow, look at that one, dude. Same thing, the fins, so gorgeous. Another one, another one, a lot of Africans today. Oh, here's another good one. Oh, that's a good one. Look at that, dude, so sick. Oh, it's getting windy, throw the bluegill back. Throw the mine back. Oh, it's so windy, dude. It's a hurricane out here and another African. Oh, guys, that was a pretty good, that was two good fish traps. Caught a lot of nice Africans in the big one. And we caught some baby Jack Dempsey's in the other one. Yo, look at this molly. This molly's like a Dalmatian. Oh, it is a Dalmatian. Oh, that's sick. Real quick, guys, we got a separate bucket. We're going to sort the Jack Dempsey's into this one just to see how many we got. I'm really curious. All right, we got two. Let's get them in there. Three. Holy crap. Dude, we got so many. Four. Freaking five. Jeez. And we had that one that escaped. We got five baby Jack Dempsey's. Let's get a nice little close look for them. Let's get a nice little look for you guys. Those are baby Jack Dempsey's. They're so tiny. I wonder how old these guys are. It looks like they're all from the same, same batch, I guess. We got five of them. All right, let's head home. Okay guys, we've made it back to the house. We got the fish here. I decided we're gonna feed most of them to the fish just because, you know, we gotta start being picky with the ones we keep because we have so many in the cichlid and paku pond. We gotta start only keeping the really colorful ones, but yeah. Also, yes, we definitely need placos for this pond like really, really bad. I mean, it, we just got algae everywhere. The UV filter broke, so we need some placos in here ASAP. We'll, we'll make a video on that soon, but let's go ahead and feed the fish. <laughs> Oh, we got him. Jeez, dude. Oh, another little ugly African. We're not gonna keep the ugly boys, only the colorful ones. Oh, <laughs> here's one of the big pretty ones. You just, he, you can't tell because he's been in the bucket, but that's one of the big alpha males. So we'll put him in the pond. There you go, buddy. Oh, look at that. We caught a little jewel too. A little African, a little jewel. There they go. Oh my gosh. That is insane. Come on, Wayne, go for one. Dude, Wayne is such a picky eater. He only eats pellets. It's so annoying. <laughs> okay, now that the fish are fed, we got the Jack Dempsey's. They're all in there, all five of them. Let's try to net them out. We're gonna put them into the quarantine tank and you guys are gonna get to decide where we put them, either in the cichlid pond or in the cichlid tank. So comment below where we should put them. There we go. Here they are. Look at them, dude, they're so sick. Oh, those are so sick. We got four of them. I thought we had five. I think I let one go, like by accident, when I was cleaning the water, but four baby Jack Dempsey's. All right, here we go. There you go, guys. So sick. All right, they're chilling. They're chilling in there. Oh, there's one of our catfish. There's one of the catfish. What's up, buddy? Look at those specks, dude. They're so cool. The blue and gold. They're such cool fish. Real quick guys, let me show you the koi pond. Look, in the last video or the second to last video, it was so murky and algae filled, but we got a new pump in there. This guy is doing work. It's only been there a day and the pond is crystal clear once again. So yeah, it's looking amazing. I'm definitely gonna have to do like a big vlog update type video just cause we have so much going on in the backyard now. And a lot of stuff I haven't shown you, like the crawfish that we caught in the creek, 
our fish had more babies and we have babies everywhere. Yeah, just a lot going on. We got chameleons in the back. So we're gonna update you guys in one of the next videos. Anyways, guys, that'll do it for today's video. If you did enjoy, hit the like button, subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.